in the name of Jesus. Name of Jesus. Listen, the man who is in control is the man who has taken over in the realm of the spirit. He is the one in control. If you are not taking over in the spirit realm, everything that will ever happen in the physical is already better in the spirit. So, by the agency of the prophetic, we can look and tell you that in the next two years, what you are doing is not what you will be doing. And you say, there's no way. Jesus told Peter that before the cock crow three times, you will betray me never. What are you talking about? But the man had looked in the spirit and the spirit realm is ahead of time. And he has seen the happening. And it is already encrypted. <laughs> because when he said they should pray, they didn't pray. When he said pray, lest you enter into temptation, they didn't pray. It is already encrypted. And he said, before he cropped twice, I strike. You will betray me three times. He said, never. Even if I have to die, I am ready to die. When the thing cropped the third time, he looked at the face of Jesus. And Jesus was looking at him. He said, didn't I tell you? The spirit is ahead of the physical. I saw it coming. And he couldn't pray. And I thought it was going to happen. So it is only the man who has the power to stand in the spirit. To alter outcomes. Who can determine the things that will happen in the physical. So Jesus spoke and he said... That the time has come that the son of man will die. And on the third day he arose. They didn't get him. He has already seen the dead and the resurrection. He knew that he couldn't stay in the grave. It is encrypted. Hey. What can you encrypt? What can you encrypt? What can you encrypt on your knees? What can you encrypt in the spirit of my prayer? What can you encrypt? Hey, the years ahead of me are encrypted. The years ahead of me they are encrypted. I don't know about you. I am a man of the altar. I am a man of the altars. Ayata, Alibilit. The years ahead of me are encrypted. The years ahead of this ministry they are encrypted by the Holy Ghost. Ayata. The will of God for my life. For the years ahead, we are gripped on the altar. We are gripped on the altar. We are gripped on the altar. Ranta kapata. Iko balata. Iko belata. Rakata. Before Peter was in trouble, Jesus looked at Peter and he said that the devil has sought to sit you like this. He said, but I have prayed for you. By prayer, the outcome was altered. The problem came, but Peter couldn't, couldn't be destroyed. Because somebody else saw it and already entered into that realm and made, lifted an incense to cancel the outcome, to alter the outcome. So he said, the enemy has sought to save you as sweet. And he said, but I have prayed for you. And he said, therefore, when I was converted, he knew that the man would be converted. The man will not be lost. The soul of the man will not be lost. Because he already said, I have prayed. Have you prayed? There are things that shouldn't be lost. If man will pray, he said, Peter, your soul will not be lost. Because I already made prayer. The quota of prayer has been made. It is encrypted. Your soul will not be lost. Listen, so Jesus already did something and said that your soul will not be lost. Why? Why wouldn't your soul be lost? He said, I have prayed. What is your assurance that something will not be lost? Have you prayed? The man peeped into the future. Everything is going to happen. If you don't have the advantage of entering into the future, you might not necessarily have to see a vision, but you can enter there on your knees. 
Your prayer has the power to go into your future. You don't know. That's why you don't pray. If you knew that your prayer can move, hey, if you knew that your prayer can move five years ahead of you, two weeks ahead of you, three months ahead of you, you will never joke with prayer. You will never joke. You have known that the reason why the stress wouldn't come is because we are prayed. For me, I cannot fall because I have prayed. I cannot fall to immorality because I have prayed. 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 I have you don't know what is going on. It is a move of God that has begun. Have you not noticed that for the past one week or two weeks, the, the message, everything is different? Because there was a demon blocking me. It is gone. May the Lord help you and I. Let the hand of God come upon you. Let the fire of a revivalist. The fire for revival. Let your prayer fire be activated. Your prayer altar. Every prayer altar that has gone down. Shalatas. Belalu sata. Hele malu sekete maluta. Let the angels, let the angels, let the angels. Let the angels. Hey. Come down now. Set on fire. Prayer altars. Let them be set on fire. Prayer altars. Some of you coals of fire will come upon you. I tell you from today, when you take off, I take a malata takapaluta. I imbele takataya. Ele malisa takapatua. We are no more the same. Hey. Travel ahead of your of your, your, your generation. Men traveled ahead of your, their generations. They spoke into several generations that were supposed to come before them. Because they grew above their generation. The depth of the operation of the spirit, the depth of their intercession, their intercessory capacities were so enhanced that they traveled ahead of their generations. And altered ways to affect your generation. So that you're in your hands. <laughs> Somebody else has bought it. Somebody else has traveled so much in the street to buy it. Spirit of the Lord. Let your fire come upon us. Let the prayer fire. The mantles of the fathers. The mantles of the Deborahs, the Deborahs, the Deborahs, the, Deborahs. the mantles of the Esthers, hey, Salatas, the mantles of the Deborahs and the Esthers. You will be a woman, but the woman who is a Deborah. You will be a woman, but an Esther that can deliver the entire generation. You can ransom the entire nation. 
Hey, you will answer with the whole family. That mantle is coming upon you. You will be a woman, but you will answer with the family on your knees by your intercessory power. Ayatata. You will ransom your family, ransom the territory. You will speak to the nation. Hey, Holy Ghost. <laughs> Let the Daniels arise. Let the Samson's. Let the Daniels. Hey, the Joseph's. Let the Debbie's arise. The Solomon's with wisdom that down found the earth. Let them arise, Holy Ghost. Let the Paul's arise, the Peter's arise. Let them arise. Let them arise. Let them arise. Lift your hands and cry to God now. Cry. Just talk to Him from the depth of your heart. Tell Him something. Ask for something. He's giving you something. What you are demanding. And in this atmosphere, what you are asking, you are getting. You are getting. Hey. You have been here. Oh, 